Hi, I'm Nikki Holland. I'm Lucy Hall. I'm Tom Bishop. My parents were runners and um, I always used to swim as a kid and I was quite a good swimmer and you kind of get the aerobic fitness from the swimming so I found out I was quite good at doing triathlon. I've been a swimmer since a very young age, I started at about six. I started running at secondary school and I did both all the way through until I came to university and at that point picked up by a triathlon team, got involved with British Triathlon about age 19 and I've been involved ever since. I started triathlon when I was eight years old, really pretty much stuck to my dad, um, he used to do like a few Ironmen, then my dad entered me in like a sort of like little kids triathlon, absolutely loved it and loved it ever since. You know, there's so many things that I really enjoy about triathlon, but for me, what originally uh, struck me was that I could continue swimming and running to a high level, uh, doing both, I didn't have to choose between them. So the variety aspect was, was huge for me. You know, I really just like pushing myself to, to the extreme. I love that we have three disciplines, like what sport can you say that you can do such a variety in training. We get to swim in the pool, we get to like go and do long rides, it's beautiful. And then the run trails around here is gorgeous as well. My proudest achievement is um, my medals as a junior and under 23 in triathlon. Um, I got a silver as a junior in 2010 and I got a bronze in 2011 and 2012. Uh, my proudest achievement I think was um, getting selected for London 2012. Competing in the London 2012 Games, that was an incredible experience and I don't know if anything will ever really compare to that again kind of training really hard, getting ready for London in a couple of weeks time and then a couple of weeks ago I just got a bit of an injury which has kind of sidelined me for a while. The grand final in um, Edmonton at the end of August is still kind of the big aim of the season and I reckon I can get back and uh, fit for them, no problem. Everyone strives for the Olympic Games and being able to compete and you know compete for your country. I think Rio I'm definitely aiming for. You kind of want to live up to that sort of British expectation of doing so well on the ITU Triathlon World Circuit. So um, I think that's definitely a goal of mine as well, long term. This year I've, I've made a new base for myself, um, a bit of a different approach to training. I've added some more volume in, I'm doing things a bit differently, trying, trying some new things out um, with the focus being on trying to make a, a second Olympic Games in Rio. We have a really nice group up here in Leeds, a um, group of friends that all sort of train and live together. Um, so I enjoy just kicking back, watching movies, going for dinner with friends, that kind of thing. You know, it's just try and switch off as much as possible, really. When I relax at home, usually I just like read or maybe cook, cook a nice meal or something, maybe watch a TV series. Like I'm, I, I like Game of Thrones at the moment, that's pretty good. It's hard to know what exactly it is that makes you the athlete that you are, but I think for me, I think I do well in high pressure situations. At the big races, I pull out my best result, particularly with any endurance sport, you're gonna have your highs and your lows, and you have to be able to take them all in your stride and bounce back from the lows and become even stronger from them. And I think if you can do that, you, you have a successful career. And I think that's where I've done quite well.